Buddhism video tutorial by Andrew Buckle. Now this is a plugin from Astute Graphics. I'm going to do a number of videos on the subject, but I'm just going to go through the basic stipple plugin at first. Now, first thing to do, got two paths here selected, and just go to Effect, and then Stipplism and Stipple. Just select that first. Now there is also a symbol version. I'm going to do other videos that show that. Now, first thing to do, select the preview on. Without that you can't see it, so preview on. Now, nothing actually happens, then you can actually just have to set one of these, just modify it, and then it will actually display. Now, I'm gonna actually just change the density a bit, because I don't want it that great, but you can see the general effect. It just creates lots of dots, and the, you can see the original design that was there. So I'm gonna set it to 50, just to make it a bit quicker. Now, you can change the quality as well, so you can increase that, but I'm gonna keep that at three. You can put that up, put that down, depending on what you want to speed wise you can also modify the size so you can change the size so you can see that just the dots when you change that getting bigger modify density well in this case really not an issue you modify the roundness now here if I actually click here I'm just gonna click I can actually zoom in and you can see they're fairly round now if I actually gonna go out there and now go to effect again, stipple, zoom, stipple, and preview. Go and change up to 50, so it's a bit quicker. Now, you can set the roundness. You can actually put it down to two, and if you do that, you'll actually see, and it's very subtle, and it is very subtle, to be honest, but you can actually see they sort of like blend in, they sort of become less, more sort of random. Anyway. That's roundness. And there's another setting here, detail. I'm not going to go into that. That's obviously as soon as you put it to 100, it goes back out to uh, there. Now, key thing here is colour. Now you can see, well, I had originally, obviously this had, down here you can see the original colours. Here you can see it's just black. So if you don't want black, sadly you can't actually select gradients or other things. It'd be nice if you could, but just going to select the colour. And you can see straight away you've got the colour of those objects they've passed. So, and also sample object. Well, sample object, it actually takes the colour. So instead of just that, you can actually use sample object. Just select that. And again, quickly go through. And video is always going to be a bit slower. It always takes a bit longer to process. It's obviously doing the video and the thing. So, and there you've, you've got actually see the original colours as well, just again as dots. And, well that's it basically, run through for this plugin, stipple plugin, but there's obviously lots of things you can do with this. Not just this, but uh, this is just a first quick run through, showing you some of the things. And again, ignore slow processing it, so it doesn't come up with a message all time. So once you click OK, that's it. So now you've got the effect there. Now, to actually show the most useful feature of this, it's actually the appearance, so you've got actually a live effect, if you want to call it, and you'll notice that live effect is there. So you can actually just remove it. You don't have to have it, you can just remove it, or you can put it back on again. Or you can actually, just done that, just click and you can actually bring up the dialog again and again. Unfortunately, that's not sticky. I'd love to see it sticky preview. I think it should always be on, but anyway, that's my preference. Preview should be on, but uh, unfortunately it's not. And then you can actually modify the settings and you obviously see the changes there. Right, that's a just quick run through of this wonderful little plugin from Astute Graphics. Hope you found this of interest. Thank you much.